Hi, this is Eric from LD Products, and I'm here today to show you how to replace a Canon PGI-280 cartridge in your Canon PIXMA TR-8520 printer. A brand new Canon PIXMA TR-8520 includes the Canon PGI-280 black and CLI-281 color setup cartridges, which feature five different colors, black, cyan, magenta, yellow, and photo black. It's important to note that two different black cartridges are required for this printer series, the PGI-280 black and the CLI-281 black. You'll need both cartridges installed in your printer in order for it to function properly. Cartridges are sold in a standard yield size, a high yield or XL size, and an extra high yield or XXL size. The high yield and extra high yield cartridges offer considerably more ink and are a great option if you print regularly. If you're getting poor print results, the first thing you want to do is check the ink levels on your printer's display. And you can do that by selecting the settings button here. And then hit estimated ink levels. And you'll notice that our uh, PGI black cartridge here is depleted. And that's what we're going to be replacing today. Replacing a cartridge in this machine is easy. The first thing you want to do is lift up the entire scanner unit and wait for the cartridges to center. So we've got the uh, scanning unit open and we can go ahead and take out the cartridge we want to replace, this uh, black cartridge here. So go ahead and push in the tab a little bit and gently pull up and it'll slide right out. And I've got a brand new PGI-280 black cartridge that we're going to be installing. So let me take that out of the packaging. Okay, so you'll notice there's a little bit of plastic here that we can remove and then also an orange clip. So we've got a bit of packaging here we want to remove before we install the cartridge. I usually like to do this uh, over a trash can because sometimes a little bit of ink may escape from the cartridge during this process, so better safe than sorry. Let me take it out here and take off the plastic first. So we've got an orange piece of tape here on the end and also an orange clip. We're gonna to need to remove both. Uh, the orange clip is here to protect the cartridge uh, while it's in transit, so we can definitely take that off. We don't need that uh, for the installation process. It won't fit in the printer if the orange clip is still there. So let's remove that first. And it'll just pop right off like that. Okay. And then this uh, orange piece of tape we also want to remove. This orange piece of tape is covering up the vent hole on the cartridge. So let's just peel that off. All right. Uh, so let's uh, install the cartridge. And here we go. Installation is uh, very easy. Let's just slide it back into the same slot we took out the old cartridge and then just gently push down on it to click. And then we can close up the front cover. And it'll be processing here for a couple of moments. And it's confirming that we've installed a brand new black cartridge. We'll click OK. And a final confirmation message here, just showing that the uh, black cartridge ink levels are full. And just go back to the main home menu, and we're all set. You're good to print.